I was not expecting this from Louis Vuitton. I, I feel like they honestly surprised us all. It, the, like, it's so orange. Receipt, because we are gonna be going over prices. They wrapped this really nice. Okay, oh my gosh. All right, I love this. I love the classic Louis Vuitton packaging. Okay, wow. Okay, like this, I was expecting it to look a little bit more like there was more in here. All right. It smells, smells good, it smells leathery. Yes, made in France. That's like the first thing I was looking for. I have this set and it's not made in France. It's made in Spain, which I don't mind, but I just, oh, okay, stop. I need to open this and show you guys. Oh my gosh, the pink in here is gorgeous. Okay, so this is the Louis Vuitton Trio Toiletry Pouch. That is the official name. Oh, wow, I even like the red. It's like one of those Russian dolls where you open it and like with little tinier pieces just keep popping out. This one was the one I was most waiting for. Da, 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 da. Oh, oh my God. That is so beautiful. Oh my gosh. I'm actually really impressed with this pink. I was not, I was not expecting this. Okay. Okay. Let me, let me get myself together here. Okay. So this is the trio. Let me put this here so you guys can see. This is the trio toiletry pouch. Louis Vuitton just released this. I believe they release, released it either on the 4th or the 5th of April. Uh, I had saw on Instagram that it was gonna be released, I think on the 4th, and I went on the website, it wasn't there. And then I checked again the next day, cause I was like, was this just an April Fool's thing? I didn't know if it was just one of those things where it was like just a joke. So I checked again on the 5th and they it was there. And the price, oh my God. Okay, let's just, hold on a second. Let me get this, oh wait. Okay, wait, let me get my phone. I have the prices here on my phone. Okay, so this is the old version. This is the new version. The price for all three of these. So this is sold now in a set. It's the trio pouches. So they are sold as a set and the price point is $14.90. They didn't used to be sold as a set. They used to be sold individually, so you would buy the 26, the 19, or the 15, and individual sizes. So for all three of these, when they were discontinued in, in summer of 2021, the total for all of these was $16.10. So $16.10 minus $14.90, minus fourteen ninety, hundred and twenty dollars difference. I'm like, I'm like shocked right now. I'm like so shocked. You're actually saving money now with these that Louis Vuitton released them. And just a reminder, the old ones are just this plain beige, beige-ish pink color inside, which is gorgeous, which is absolutely gorgeous. There's, I'm not mad at it. There's nothing wrong with it. It is so beautiful. It's very timeless. It's very classic. But these all have a pop of color. It's so unexpected. It's so much fun. I did not think I would like it as much as I do this. Oh my gosh, this pink. I am literally blown away. Okay. All right, let's start over again. I wanted to get that price out for you guys, but let's start from the beginning. So these toiletry pouches were wildly popular at Louis Vuitton. I, I've said this so many times. There's that famous picture of Princess Diana. She has it under her arm. She's at the beach and I'm just like imagining that she has sunscreen in there, that she has like some lip balm, maybe some sunnies in there, some sunglasses. I mean, it's just, this is a very popular, well-loved piece from Louis Vuitton. And I, I was not sure why they discontinued it. And after they discontinued it, there, Louis Vuitton came out with so many different versions. They came out with a version that had a strap to it. And when you opened it, there was like pockets and there was all this stuff. And for me, I was like, 
I liked it. It was a, it's a cute little clutch. It's a great little purse. But my whole thought was that this was meant to be a toiletry pouch. Like that's why the inside is basically like waterproof. The lining in here is meant to be a toiletry pouch. I did hear a rumor that one of the reasons Louis Vuitton discontinued this was because people were figuring out how to make these into handbags by adding the chain themselves, you know, buying the insert that already had the chain connected to it. And because there's a hole on the other side over here, do these have the hole? Yes, these are literally, like literally exactly the same. You could easily put an insert in here and then the chain could come out of both ends and it's, it's a handbag. And these were like, under under $600 for a Louis Vuitton handbag. So I think they got smart, they caught on, and they were like, nope, we're discontinuing this. But then all the versions that they came out with, just, I, I honestly don't think that they did very well. When I looked on the website, they were always in stock, and the price went really high. I don't exactly remember the price, but it just, I, I, I don't know, I, I think they got lost, so, I don't know who suggested this, but whoever suggested this, this is fantastic. So many people, I think, wanted these toiletry pouches before they left Louis Vuitton, but Louis Vuitton, like they, once they were gone, they were sold out and they were gone. So now they've re-come out with this. You get to buy it in a set, which I think is great because it takes the guesswork out of it. When I first bought them, I had only bought the the 26 i had only bought the bigger one and then i was like do i need the smaller ones and i didn't really quite know if i needed the smaller ones and i actually didn't buy the two smaller ones until i found out they were getting discontinued and then i was like well i, I I'll, I'll probably find a purpose for them and i actually do find a purpose for them i will say i use the big one and the small one the most the medium one i've said it before in a few videos i'm still kind of like I, I still struggle with this one. It's almost too, it's too big to go into my smaller bags and it's too small to be in my bigger bags. But I also haven't traveled like that that much in the past few years. These are literally, literally the exact, there is, there is no difference. And actually this newer one feels like I cannot be thicker. It just feels a little thicker. I, I'm, I'm gonna say the new ones feel a tad bit thicker. I'm not sure, I'm not sure why. Maybe it's because of the color lining. But you guys, oh my gosh. Like looking inside of this with this hot pink sticking, like staring back at you. It is so much fun. So I wanna show you guys the you know original side-by-side -side next to the brand new. This is the larger size, so this is that beautiful pink interior, and this is that original beige interior next to it. Both colors are so beautiful. This is just, you know, obviously a classic, gorgeous color, but this is just like, hello, I have arrived. <laughs> Next we have the 19, this is like the medium size. Again, the classic beige, light beige, and then this beautiful fire engine red. This is such a vibrant color red. This is the smaller one. This would be considered the 15. There we go. It's almost like it can't even capture this beautiful color. Maybe is that, is that better? I gotta like, ah! The good thing is that all the original ones are on the pre-love market if you do want to go in that direction or if you want to get the brand new set, all of these are available. Brand new at Louis Vuitton. This red, if you guys are red Louis Vuitton girl, you are gonna absolutely love this. It is so bright red. It is a true fire engine, beautiful red. Like I want this red nail polish or a lipstick. It is so gorgeous. Oh my gosh. I didn't know how I would feel about these colors in here, but 
Louis Vuitton just, I, I'm going to say they, they did a really good thing here. I really enjoy this. And I'll be honest, I'm very surprised with the price point. I, I, I would not have expected them to actually underprice it from what they were before. I have a feeling it's probably an introductory price. I, you know, when something is popular at Louis Vuitton, mysteriously prices get raised really quick. So I definitely feel like the price will go up. But if you're one of those people who missed out on getting one of the original ones before they went, you know, gone, before they left, this, you will find a use for every single one of these. I honestly think every single one of these you can find a use for. If you guys have the middle size one, please let me know what you use it for. Cause I don't know, like, I love this little one to put my glasses cleaner in, to put lip glosses in. This is literally like the perfect size. And this big one I use all the time when I travel or I'm going somewhere where I'm gonna need you know, toiletries of any kind or a hairbrush. This middle one, I'm like, what are you? are like, I don't know, you're the middle child. I don't know what to do with you. I wanna show you guys what can actually fit inside of these. This is the larger size. This would be like the 26 and it has the hot pink interior. So this is kind of like what it would look like with your stuff in here and this like bright, pop of color. All right. So shampoo, conditioner, containers. I would put that in there. Uh, a skin serum. My favorite is from skin fix, some deodorant. So look how fun and colorful that is a little mini brush, some sunscreen. Okay. So that's kind of what it looks like now. I still have some room over here so maybe i would add another one of these little travel containers you guys these are literally the best travel containers and they're magnetic so it'll just stick right on there and then maybe i would add some Laneige lip product on top of there so that's what the inside would look like with all your stuff in it literally adorable that is the larger size. This is the medium size. I guess this would be considered the 19 and this has that gorgeous, beautiful red interior. And I guess just keeping with the toiletry pouch <laughs> type thing, here are the shampoo conditioners. Again, this one's a little shorter, so there's not too much room left. Maybe some face mist could put in there my glasses cleaner. It's already kind of filling up. My favorite Anastasia Beverly Hills lip gloss. This is literally what I wear in all my videos. It's my favorite. And then maybe some dental floss. So that is what that looks like in here. I could possibly also put another one of these little, little travel jars in there that would fit. Oh yeah, wow, okay. That's great, that fits perfect. I've talked about these travel jars. They are literally amazing. <laughs> They're all magnetic, they all stick. I'm like in love. This one is the smallest size, so I guess this would be considered the 15. This has that gorgeous pink interior. I hope the camera is catching this. This like, you can't even capture this in like on a camera. You have to see this in real life. It is so beautiful. I might do just two of the small like pill containers. Show you guys. These are perfect to carry. This is my vitamin D supplement. I need a little bit more sun in my life. These just magnetize together. So just put those maybe over there. A pocket mirror in there. Definitely would probably put my headphones. That's what it's looking like now. I don't think too much room in this one. This one's a lot smaller but you can still you can still put a good amount in there. Oh yeah, this is my lip gloss that I'm currently obsessed with. So that's what could fit in there. So pretty. Okay, let me, I know I've probably done a close up, but let's just do one more. I honestly kind of feel like Louis Vuitton realized they made a mistake and you know, 
put these back out. I gotta lay these down. These keep falling. Put these back out on the market. And then because they like kind of knew they made a mistake by discontinuing them because they were such a popular item, they were like, let's throw some color in there for everybody. I love the pinks. I'm not sure. I don't know. I mean, I guess they had to throw a red in there, but I almost wish, I almost wish this one would have been, the middle one instead of red could have been purple. I love purple so much. Purple is literally like my favorite color. Like this light pink, a hot pink, and then like a neon purple thrown in there. I think that would have been amazing. Definitely want to hear your thoughts, your opinions. Are you going to get this set? It is gorgeous, you guys. I think it is priced so well. The colors, okay, red, not my favorite. The colors are, oh my God, oh my God. When you look at it, it's just like happy. It's literally happiness. But yeah, are, are you guys, what are your thoughts? What are your thoughts? That's all I wanna know. Again, thank you guys so much for being here. Thank you for watching and I will see you guys on my next video.